Alameda County District Attorney Pamela Price was introduced to cheers, and then she broke into song. I ain't gonna let nobody turn me around. I'm gonna keep on a walking, keep on a talking, walking up the Freedom Road. Organizers rallied Price supporters on the steps of the Alameda County Courthouse in Oakland to counter what they see as backlash against the newly elected DA. That's what it is. It's the backlash. Anytime you stand up for justice and freedom, there's going to be a backlash. But ain't nobody gonna turn me around. DA Price outlined some of her accomplishments, which include prioritizing victim services, hiring more lawyers and investigators, establishing new guidelines and procedures for charging and sentencing, and launching new programs around restorative justice, policies which she campaigned on. We launched a pilot program in collaboration with the court for transitional youth ages to 18 to 25 who got caught with a gun for the first time to divert them from the criminal legal system and pair them with mentors and not give them a felony. Her supporters criticized some early recall efforts and strongly refute claims that Price has been soft on crime. It seems before, it's just that the, the DAs, uh, the deputy DAs had, what, they could throw whatever in Enhancements they wanted. We have over, over criminalized young people. We have over criminalized people of color. And she's coming in and we're saying, no, we're going to reform this. And people don't like it. If anybody take a life, they need all the enhancements they can get. Yeah. They need to be in jail for life with no parole. A group of about a dozen people held a rally before and then during the Price rally. They argue that Price hasn't been transparent in some cases, such as with Jasper Wu a child who was killed by stray bullets on I-880 during what police say was a gun battle between rival gangs. They're also concerned about Price's sentencing policies. Like I said, transparency with these cases where we could understand, then I think that would really help the community. This system was not broken in a day. It will not be fixed in a hundred days. It's just not possible. Price says she inherited an organization that was in chaos. She criticized the media for allegedly not being as critical of her predecessor, Nancy O'Malley. She ended by reminding the crowd that she won on a platform for change, which she intends to deliver. Change takes time and patience and courage and telling the truth. In Oakland, on Hassan, ABC 7 News.